Warning, Gentle Rubazoid contains adult humor, adult content, biting satire, and dark comedy. Viewer discretion is advised. Worst Kamala Harris yet because, quote, you don't hire someone unless you give them an interview, unquote. Is that all it takes? Will he endorse Harris after today? Uh, you know, I think that he is doing his job representing the Teamsters, which is he is making it clear that they aren't committing to a particular party just because of a party affiliation. But what he cares about is who is going to be best for workers, who's going to be best for unions. Now, the reality is that a lot of the things that he wants and that he wants for the Teamsters, such as making it easier uh, for other workers to join a union, to join the Teamsters, um, those kinds of things are more, he's more likely to get out of Vice President Harris in the same way he's been more likely to get it, get support for unions out of President Biden. Um, you even had, as you noted, President Trump sort of giggling with Elon Musk which is, you know, the way to keep workers in line is fire them if they threaten to organize or they threaten to strike. That's not going to win any favors uh, or support from the union. So I would be surprised if we don't see a Teamsters endorsement of Kamala Harris. But I think it's also worth noting how you know tough they're being about saying you don't get it for free. We're making sure that you're out there representing the interests. <laughs>